Hello, everyone. I have a haul for you today. Filled with antique jewelry boxes. Also jewelry. And various aged items. Here, I have a butterfly pin. It's so old, with the claps on the back. Beautiful, beautiful bracelet. Very old. And here is quite old jewelry box. As you can see inside, mint condition. Pearls that they used to wear to church. Aren't they beautiful? And these are just red snap beads that they used to get at the five and dime store for 10 cents. And I think I'm going to start calling my videos. Let's see. What falls over today? Every time I make a video, like at Christmas, my tree fell over. At Easter, my egg fell over. And last week, my two-tiered tray fell over. This is a very, very old clip back earring. And I would imagine that it was worn with these beads because the orange matches. Again, probably purchased at the five and dime store. I think it's beautiful. And I can't believe how well it has held up. This little porcelain jewelry box is even older. And you can see inside, still in mint condition. I love that too. And I think what I'm going to do is place this locket. This is so old that my mother's brother gave it to me. He said it was hers when she was a child. So when they both were children. And of course, that's a clip, a brooch is what they would call it. So it could be a necklace or it could be a brooch. I'm going to place that in the jewelry box. This is ceramic, I believe. I don't think it's porcelain. The beautiful bracelet. old, very old, and I believe that they probably wore this clip back earring with that to church because they were church ladies. And don't get it twisted, 
just because we're church ladies doesn't mean you can walk over us. Here is a beautiful little evening bag. It is in such good condition. Has a long handle. But most people, they carry it like this. You can see inside. A little pouch. Perfect. Don't mind that. Here, for my people in Baltimore, Maryland, this is the U.S. Coast Guard. where my family worked, in Curtis Bay, Maryland. You can see all the water. At the Coast Guard Yard. I have another old picture for you. And I have shown this before. I think it's worthy to be seen again in its original frame. And I absolutely love this frame because of the crepe, the uh, artwork and the carving, excuse me. I love her hair. I love her attire. Her jewelry. The fadedness. The aging. Excellent. I also wanted to include this old creamer in the blue corn flower. I can't read that on the bottom, but this is old as well. And also, the gravy boat. Not sure if I've shown you this. I hope everyone is well. I really do. We're having storms today, all day. Tornado threats. I hope you are safe where you are. I have stopped sending blessings because some people don't really like that sort of thing. And I don't want to waste something on someone when someone else could use those prayers someone who's going through something and may actually want those prayers you 
but always sending seeds and shining light. I love my subscribers. I love my YouTube family. I love all the content creators. I love my family. The last thing I want to show to you, darling, is this old model car. With the wheel on the back. The doors do open. Look at those tires and that bumper. Gifted to a family member of mine by my uncle. So this is my vintage haul for today. I really wanted to focus on the jewelry and the jewelry boxes, the purses, isn't that pretty? Doesn't want to sit up. I'm used to my things falling now. Curtis Bay, Maryland, Baltimore, U.S. Coast Guard. One less pan. This beautiful portrait. And I absolutely hope that you enjoyed this haul, this very old, not vintage, not antique, but old collection of many things. And if you would like me to, there's a vintage shop here that I can take you to where they have so many beautiful aged things. Just look at what you could get at a five and ten cent store. Take care, fam. Sending seeds of joy and shining light. Don't want to be big. I just want to be appreciated. Subscribe if you like the channel. I shall return.